Hello everyone, this tutorial is going to help you set up your uh, calendars in Microsoft Outlook and organize your navigational pane. So let's go ahead and open up Outlook. And you'll see down here you'll have these four options here. This is the calendar, this is folders, this is mail, and task. These three little dots help you um, manipulate those. So what we can do is go to navigation options. You'll see I'll ha I have three other types of uh, displays here. So if I want to display those, I can just say I want to display all eight, maximum number, hit OK, and it'll show me all four, all eight of those. Now, most of your screens are going to look like this, so it is going to be cut off a little bit, so you can just expand that if you like that. If you don't like that, you can go ahead and go back to Navigation Pane and take it down to five or four, okay? Uh, compact Navigation uh, makes it put a menu bar down here at the bottom, so again, you want to put all eight there. You can see all of those there. And like I said, it just puts it at an, a navigation bar down at the bottom. You can also take ones that you want to see up first and you can move them around. If I don't want, I want to see calendars kind of in the third one or move it up, I would say you're going to want to see calendars, folders, mails, and, and tasks if you use that. But these are the main three calendar, folders, and mails. So again, you can either have that navigational. Um, so it just depends on what you like. It automatically defaults. What you're going to see first is the compact view. So we'll leave it there for now. All right, so now here are your calendars. Okay, I have two calendars up here, but most of you will probably usually only have one. Okay, um, here's your folders all your different folders here, and then there's your mail. Okay, so what we're gonna do is and make turn make a, the Beach Tree calendar, um, how information is disseminated to you, um, visible on your uh, Microsoft Outlook. So what you're gonna do is go to, click on the files. You wanna scroll down until you see all uh, public folders for you. Oh, drop that down and that will show you your favorites and your all public folders. So what we're going to do is open all public folders and we're going to go find the beach tree calendar. Um, that's going to be under all public folders and then you're going to look for schools and you're going to look for beach tree. And then you're going to find the BT calendar. That's what it's called, BT. You're going to right click on that and you can say add to favorites. Okay, that's the only thing you're going to do, add to favorite. Okay, and I want you to do that you can go back to I'm going to scroll up to the public folders again. You're going to close all public folders. You're going to see your favorites, open up favorites, and there it is right there. You can go ahead and, and click on that, and that will pull up the BT uh, Beach Tree folder. So this is how information or uh, things are going to be disseminated or you're going to be able to look at that. So one of the things I would get in the habit of doing is every morning, go to your folder, or I'm sorry, your calendar, and you're gonna see your calendar. And then if you hit on other calendars, it's a different name in uh, calendar view, you're gonna see BT calendar. And then you can see both calendars side by side. The one on the left is my calendar, the one on the right is the beat, uh, beat tree. So you can see they have all the testing dates in there. So that's something that you really wanna get used to uh, looking at. All right, if you have any questions, uh, don't feel, feel free to uh, email me or come find me. Thank you very much.